Hey, what is up everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. And, as you can see, there's quite a few differences. Um, I, f I forgot to do the F1 thing, okay. Never mind, um, is it F5? Yes, it is. I I'm forgetting my hotkeys now, there's so many programs that use different keys. But anyways, over here, that I fell down, is a cactus farm, um, which I'm still working on. And you may have seen my live stream, which was kind of a fail, where I was trying to build this, and it's only produced a little bit so far, but at the same time, I haven't really been in the area too much, and haven't played that much since. But, um, the goal is to finish this, um, eventually. Um, and... Once I'm finished with the cactus, because it's going to be producing it a lot, um, I will change the walls out to be green... Um, concrete and there's probably gonna be something here like a building and you may notice I'm using a texture pack um, it is mine tweaks it is my own of uh, vanilla tweaks whatever it is a custom texture pack that I've built on the vanilla tweaks website thing um, so I've got a few things from it um, for example the grass the path blocks um, I also like that um, a whole bunch of things are quieter, for example, pressure plates, they barely make a sound, buttons barely make a sound, but I think it just makes everything look nicer. And also, my favourite thing is connected glass. Um, it looks so much better, I think. And of course my world has trouble loading in right now. Um, but I think, like, look at how beautiful that is. That is so much better. Um, yeah, borderless glass is awesome. There's a few other things, but they're quite unnoticeable. Um, and also, you may notice I have completed this sheep farm. The only thing I'm missing is brown. Um, but I can't get that. And I have sheared them already once. We've got a few different things around here. And as we talked about, this is going to be white and this is going to be white as well. And that's reserved for brown. Um, so yes, this is pretty much complete. And... Yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. Um, just need to work on the tunnel here a little bit, maybe. But otherwise, this is done. Um, I also did something I've been kind of putting off lately. Um, I fa finally done this door. Um, I don't have any more nether, nether quartz. Nether quartz? Quartz, yeah. Um, I'm starting to forget Minecraft now. And there's going to be a button here, just a simple button here. And as you can see, there was a slight delay. That is, I'm going to show you the redstone in a second. But yeah, I've got pressure plates on this side though. Um, the reason it stays open for a little bit longer is because of a little thing called a pulse extender. I think is what it's called properly. Um, it is just over there. It's basically two comparators and they g feed into each other and they extend the pulse a bit um, So it's a bit longer and it's just super useful um, for some things So yes, I got that done. I need to have something on the outside here, but that that's for later and Yes, so this is pretty much done and I, I don't know why I did these stairs here. I'm thinking of getting rid of them because, like, this this just goes down. And it goes down to the same level, I think. That's, that was 68. Yeah, this is 68 as well. So I might have might as well just had it going straight. I don't know what I was thinking of. But anyways, that is done, pretty much. Um, just need to have a back door, but I'll, I'll fix that some other time. I'll put it off some more. Um, yes, I've been rambling here. Also off camera, I went and did a whole bunch of exploring in the end. Got a whole bunch of shulker shells, gonna make some shulker boxes with that. Um, got got three mending books now. And I also have a new pick, Stone Crusher, which does not have a silk touch on it. And yes, I'm happy with that. And also this pick's gonna die soon. Um, I, th I think I can repair it one more time and then I won't be able to. But yes. Today's project is gonna is I'm gonna work on the cactus farm a little bit more, um, and then I was thinking of doing a few other things, but I don't know. 
Um, I also tried out a little thing over here. This is best look to see us at night. Um, got a bunch of hidden lighting, a bunch of decoration. Um, I, I, I think I'm gonna get rid of the flowers because they add too much color to this. Like I want texture, not color. Maybe I'll keep the red ones, but I don't like because but I just don't like the yellow ones at all. Um, but yes, this this is for good for hidden lighting and stuff like that, and. I'm gonna have this kind of style throughout the whole village, I think, and like around all of my main areas. And I sh I want to get it done by episode 15 because on episode 50 I was thinking of doing a world download for you guys, so you can check out this world. And I'm betting you right now that someone's gonna go and blow it up, and they're gonna be like, "Hey, I blew up your world." I'm I'm just gonna be like, "I don't care." Um, but yes, let let me get a few things together then. I forgot to show you this. The gear that you get from the end cities is like amazing. Like, look at this stuff. It has mending on it. This has mending on it. Two elytras. Mending. Mending. Just an awesome sword for killing spiders. Mending. Yeah. Pretty good stuff. Hey, I have some quartz on me. Oh, yeah, I made some earlier. Um. Hey, I do have some quartz, I can finish that. Never mind, I'll finish that door real quick. Whoops, I destroyed a little too much there. Okay. My haste beacon reaches here. That's pretty awesome. And there. What should I put a redstone? door here. Is it going to get powered from something? Pretty it's going to get powered. Um, an iron door, I mean. And I'll, I'll leave it like this for now. Awesome. And now I need to clean all this up. Alright, so this is more of a streaming material kind of thing that I would do, but who cares? I should probably do a little bit on camera, and I nearly fell there. Um, and I've tested that this, my, the method here will work, um, I've tested that, um, so, basically got to repeat what's down there, but up here, and the only problem I have with this is that if something falls down, it's, it's got a very high chance of falling in a cactus, um, so, got to be extremely careful when breaking blocks, and I nearly lost my shulker box, that was very close, um, so, yes, just have to be careful and if it does miss the cactus then it's just gonna end up in the hopper over there which collects everything um, later I'll have a big collection system that will bring it all up to the surface so yes just got to do this layer quickly and then I'll be back and this layer is done um, something that came up came up um, came to my mind whilst I was doing this is lighting because I'm not quite sure if cactus will grow in the dark but A to be on the safe side and B this has to look good somewhat good um, so I'm just gonna put torches oh, I can't put torches there I swear I was able to do that at some point in the game so what should we do alright well on this layer once I put the, all the sand down then I'm gonna put a few torches on the sand on the sides of it. I think I'll be fine. So, let's do this layer and then I'll add the lighting as well. Because this also has to look nice even if sand if even if cactus can grow in the dark. Place the sand down. So, the next step would be to add the glass panes, which is to be honest the hardest thing for me because I had no idea where to put them and I had to experiment with ways that it would be efficient, not take up too many panes and symmetrical. So, yes, I, I'm just going to copy what's at, down at the bottom there, but this may take a little bit of time. And I may need a few blocks, which I don't have. So, I'm probably going to have a whole bunch in here. Yeah. Let's, t let's, take, let's take some cobble. Shelker boxes are so much fun. This is my step touch, yes. Good stuff. 
Alright, well I finished um, doing all those paints, so now it's just time to add the cactus, and there's been cactus popping here and there all the time, so that's mm, nice. Quite, that's quite a bit. Uh, however, this is going to require quite a bit more than that. Um, so I'm just going to put this back in, and I'm going to start on the next layer. Um, the, I don't like working at night. I really don't like working at night. Um, the sound that the husk makes just make, makes me so creeped out, and there's a whole bunch up here. Yeah. Let's, let's go sleep. I shot this guy. Um, hopefully I can sleep. Yes. Anyway, I shall work a bit more on the cactus farm. And that's two more layers built. I'll probably put another layer up above, um, above this one, but not right now. Right now I will look, look at the time of the episode, put some cactus down, and then we might do something else. Might, um, I don't know, I, I'm kind of running out of time, I have a bunch of things to do. Um, so, we'll, we'll see, but I should be able to do something real quick. So, yes. Okay, well, I have figured out something. Um, we don't have very much time left, so it's going to be a sl bit grindy for the next, like, ten minutes. But I figured out what we're going to do. Um, I would like to start using the end a bit more. Like, I need ender pearls and stuff like that. I'm going to build the ender ender probably next episode. Probably, but n that's not guaranteed. And I needed the coordinates. So I can get to the um, end center of the end portal faster. These are the coordinates of the center of the end portal. And what we're going to do is build a massive um, ice ice road for like a boat or something. So it's a little bit more this way. Right here. Right, so then if you go straight from here, then you will end up in the end. So I just want to see if there's a better building place for this, so I'm just going to follow this line. Um, maybe I can put something over here. Um, and it's Y16, so... Like, right over there would be perfect, I think. Next to the tree farm. Right around here. Yes. It's not centered with that, though. Okay. Right here. Is where I would need to dig. So... Do I want it perfectly centered though? Hmm. Interesting. I can't decide. Alright, I have decided. Um, I'm just going to have a staircase going down here. Not centered with the farm. Um, but it's going to be there anyway. Um, and when we get down to Y16. Um, I'm going to dig straight until I hit the portal, um, pretty much, and then I'm going to need to get some ice, and what I want to do is use um, packed ice, but I don't have a spike biome, unfortunately, that's like the worst thing, um, but might have to make do with normal ice for right now, basically I'm going to have a boat, boat way, um, so boats go very fast on ice, so that's what I'm gonna do here. So that's it's like easy to do. Like, it, like I could just run it, but who would want to do that? Um, nearly there. And for now, I'm just gonna dig two blocks um, like this um, and then later I'll switch out um, to digging a 3x3 three three tunnel um, but for right now I'll just dig this um, I'm, I might make this bed up so yeah 
Got to make this sped up. Alright, so we're nearly there, um, I'm starting to hear mobs now, and, yes, we are so close, I can't even pick things up anymore, um, let's get rid of that stuff. And I don't need that. Yes. So close. And we came from the back, which is actually pretty good. Um, I'm happy with coming from the back here. Um, so let's go into here so that we can get back home easily. Um, and it might be the end of the episode, I don't know. Um, like I dearly want to end it, but I also dearly want for you to enjoy at least the last bit. Um, let's look at the advancements here. Um, I need to brew a potion, need to summon a wither, construct a beacon and get some nether wart, which I can get really quickly. I need to trade with a villager, which I can easily do. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Um, every biome. At least it tells me which one to actually do and stuff. And then a whole bunch of stuff here. Um, so I'll need to respawn the dragon and stuff. Um, and yeah. We'll do that some other time. But right now we are back here. And I need to push all my cobbles somewhere. Uh, okay. Let's dump it in here. At least I have some cobble because before I had like none and it was really annoying. Okay. No, not my pick. Um, where can I put that? Here. That's all good I think. Uh, let's just convert this to torches. Yeah, that's pretty good, I think. Um, so, in the next episode, um, I'll I'll try to build the end ender. Uh, I don't know which design I'm gonna go for yet. Um, I might go for the endermite one and drop them down quite a few blocks, um, or I might. Oh, they fixed this. I'm happy with that now. Um, I might do a simple one. Wait 
pretty simple one I mean where they get pushed off with pistons um, I don't know I'll, I'll, I'll decide and then I'll try to work on that a bit more um, what I'll do on to work on the tunnels that I'll probably blow blow some stuff up because I needed to actually be a 5x5 five five. the tunnel itself was going to be a 3x3 three three, but to work with it I need to be a 5x5 five five so that I can have the walls the roof and the um, other thing something else rather than just a boring thing um, boring stone so yes thanks for watching and I'll see you all in the next one bye bye